NASA just scrubbed SpaceX's Dragon launch that was supposed to be going to the ISS. The International Space Station is what NASA launched into space so people could learn more about space. Here are five things that you should know about today's scrub launch. Number five, SpaceX is a company that's partnered with NASA. SpaceX was founded by Elon Musk. This is being launched at the Kennedy Space Center, one of SpaceX's usual launch places. Another usual one is the Cape Canaveral Space Center. There were 16 minutes, around 16 minutes before they scrubbed the launch. Scrub basically made NASA um, basically delayed SpaceX's launch because of weather. The weather was thunder showers, and that could tilt the rocket. Since 1983, when the Challenger crashed because of weather, um, everyone has been not taking any chances. So that's basically an example of what happened today. Number four, NASA scrubbed the launch when SpaceX was fueling the first tank. SpaceX uses this really cold fuel to power the rockets. That's why sometimes you see mm, mist or mist coming out of the sides of the rockets when they're launching. They use liquid oxygen. Number three, it was supposed to launch two people to the ISS for the first time in nine years, which was carrying cargo for the ISS supplies. The, the Dragon is being launched off of a Falcon 9 booster. So there's a booster, the Falcon 9 booster, then the Dragon. Once it's in space, the booster detaches from the rocket itself, and it, there's three stages. The booster, um, after the booster detaches, there's another stage, and then once that detaches, the Dragon accelerates itself. The booster lands itself. It's a smart booster. SpaceX makes smart, smart things. Elon Musk likes futuristic smart things like Teslas. It either lands on a drone ship or a or in an airspace. Once they get to the ISS, um, they open up the top of the dragon comes off and it attaches to the docking station on the ISS. Number two. But this is not the first time the dragon has been launched, although it is the first time the dragon has been launched with people. And it has been upgraded, I think. It was a very modern launch. Like the two astronauts got pulled up in a two Tesla Model X's that had a customized paint job that said NASA and SpaceX on it. And also they were wearing a different suit that, a different, like more comfortable and less bulky and messy suit. The seats are customized to fit um, the people who are flying the dragon. Like it's fit to their body so they can stay comfortable for many hours. The dragon is fully operated by a touch screen. It has an advanced parachute system that'll help it and it's splashed down. Number one. The astronauts would have got this type of practice actually because they in real life, they wouldn't have fueled up the rocket just for practice, so the astronauts got a like good practice to see everything in real life. 